Hi, my name is Vinny. I live in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. I'm 29 years old. I am HIV positive, have been for two and a half years. I'm gay. I'm totally okay with it. And I'm here today to deliver a message. And that message is not, it gets better. That's a lie. I, I can't promise you it's going to get better. I can promise you it's going to change. Things are going to get different. They're not going to be better per se because guess what? You're living life and life is a tragedy for everyone. Nobody's got a perfect life. Okay, granted. Your troubles are that you're being bullied right now. So what? That might stop, maybe, if you can learn how to stand up for yourself. Thing is, being bullied isn't a good enough reason to kill yourself. There's really no good reason to kill yourself because it just means that you're weak. And do you really want to be remembered as that weak guy who couldn't handle life I mean come on 19 million people are handling life why can't you there's something to be said in that you know um I guess I'm supposed to have some kind of good message that tells you you know this isn't this is maybe the worst that it's ever gonna be but it's not dude at at 16. I thought it would get better and I'm 29 and yeah, life is better because I've come to terms. I deal with life on life's terms and really you've kind of got no other option but to do that because I mean, what's your other choice? Death? Like, let's be weak, let's kill myself. So some guy is bullying you at school. Some buddy told everyone that you're gay. Big deal. They don't actually care. They react because there's something wrong in them. It's a reflection of them, not you. It really actually has nothing to do with you or your choice and everything to do with theirs. Um... just don't be weak because that's lame like I'm a stronger person because I can wake up every day and deal with my HIV and I can wake up every day despite the fact that my father doesn't like me and I can wake up every day despite the fact that I walk through this world alone just like you and everybody else there's no magic button to push that makes things better you just have to get better you have to evolve you have to be stronger because nobody wants the weakest link on their team and frankly if you're so weak that you've got to kill yourself do it I don't care I haven't lost anything in some kid that can't handle his life I mean, really, like, there's this whole saying of um, survival of the fittest. And, I mean, obviously, if you're killing yourself because you can't handle someone teasing you or you're killing yourself because you don't feel accepted, you're weak. Man, I don't get accepted. I work at a gay bar. Not everybody there accepts me. I don't accept all of them either. I don't have to and neither do they not everybody's gonna like everybody we're human we have our own minds we are sentient beings who have a lot more going on than anyone else sees and you know that because you can have your own internal dialogue while having an external dialogue that does not reflect it at all and that's the thing to remember is that that's happening in everyone and you know, you just have to learn how to deal. So I guess all I have to say is
don't kill yourself get stronger and if you're not gonna get stronger then all right cool I'm not losing out and I'm not gonna pity you and I'm not gonna feel bad for you and I don't think that you've done anything amazing by killing yourself I wanted to kill myself I've been there I've felt the way that you felt and you know think gee that it didn't work and that it didn't go through because I have influenced people in my life that would have never been influenced had they not known me and okay it's minuscule and it's like random people and none of them are changing or shaking the world but like maybe I will maybe I can maybe I've got that coming in my life maybe I've got what it takes to say hey I'm not putting up with it I'm not gonna let you treat me this way because I dealt with so much and you are dealing with so much so that you're prepared to be stronger and to help change the world we've got all kinds of issues I can't marry the man I love I can't go fight a war for my country you know um and that's bullshit. That's bullshit. It's not fair. And it's not going to change unless we all stand up and, and and demand the change. And laying down and letting the train run you over, that's not going to help at all. You're not making a difference. You've made a small impact because people are like, oh, you know, eight kids killed themselves. That's tragic. It's horrible. Don't get me wrong. I'm not telling you to go kill yourself if you think you're weak. I'm telling you to get stronger because you're not really weak. And all you're ever going to be re remembered as by a plethora of people is that you were weak. You were too weak to stand up and say, hey, I'm a human and I demand respect. So in closing, I just want you to remember the weak they're not needed. Uh, survival of the fittest is where it's at.